Hi everybody, Darren here from InnoPharma Technology and we're here at Acumen 2022 and I wanted to show a few more things about Smartex here, how easy it is to start a process in an automated fashion and let it control your production. So here on the right we're seeing a virtual fluid bed, we've loaded the material into the bowl as you can see but it's not started yet and we're about to launch a session here on Smartex so let me show you how easy it is to do that. We've selected the auto mode, we're going to select one of our process uh, configurations We'll select the version. Let me select the correct one, there we go. We'll give it a unique session ID. And click start. So that's initializing all the different steps of your process equipment. Here we're showing the virtual fluid bed starting up on the right. It's connecting via MQQT protocols to our ICON technology. It's using MQQT to connect to an external scales, for example. So that means you can actually bring in whatever piece of third party tech you want to. For this, a loss on weight scales has been virtually used to measure how much uh, content you're spraying onto the product. We've now gone into the live session window and it's all hands free from here because we pre-programmed it with our automation steps. We can see the virtual fluid bed is starting to fluidize, it's getting air, and we can see that ramping up here on the charts for our airflow. So they're starting to pick up speed as well. We're measuring our particle size as it goes, and this will continue until we reach a um, target profile of a certain coating thickness on these particles, as well as a moisture content, and then actually stop our process as well. So we can monitor this in real time. You can monitor as well around the world using Smartex in the cloud, so people can actually see what the process is happening. You can, your subject matter experts can maybe feed in on that. So it's really just to show how easy it is and simple to start up an automated process using Smartex. Um, I hope that was interesting. If you want to find out more information, please visit InnoPharmaTechnology.com.